bathroom. It's the place where we both begin and end our day. But have you ever wondered what the impact is of all the products we use on a daily basis? In this video I will be sharing my favorite eco-friendly swaps for the bathroom. With only a few small changes you can make a big impact in your bathroom. And some of these don't even have to cost money. The first few I will be sharing are completely free. Then there are a few that require a little bit of investment and I will end with a few eco-friendly bathroom swaps that require a little bit more investment. But let's start off with tips that are completely free. And the first one is unplug devices you're not using. The charger for your electric toothbrush, electric shavers and your blow dryer unplug anything you're not using. When they're plugged in they're using a little bit of energy and by unplugging them you save energy and therefore money. The same goes for turning off the tap where you're not using water. While you brush your teeth, wash your hands, wash your face, turn off the tap where you're not using water. Whenever possible use natural ventilation in your shower because ventilation, air conditioning requires a lot of energy. Unfortunately my shower doesn't have windows so for me it's not possible. But when you have a bathroom that has windows, open those windows when you're taking a shower for natural air ventilation. Take a shower at a colder temperature to reduce the amount of energy used to heat up water. And because it's not much fun, also make it a shorter shower. And for those of us who really don't care about the water temperature of our shower, use a shower timer to keep your shower short or play a song on your phone so you know when the song is up, you need to stop with your shower. Check for leaks in shower heads, faucets, toilets and fix them as soon as possible. Even a small drip can end up in wasting liters of water per day. When you have an older toilet, consider installing a dual flush system. So you have the option between a full flush or a partial flush, whichever you need. Alternatively, you could also use a water displacement device in your toilet, such as a bottle filled with water that you put in the water reservoir of your toilet, so with each flush you use less water. Place a bucket underneath your shower that can collect the water while you're waiting for your shower to warm up. And you can use this water to either flush toilets or water your garden. Don't throw away old towels that have become stiff and have holes in them, but instead repurpose them. You can cut them up and turn them into cleaning racks or you could donate them to animal shelters who always are in need of more towels. Don't throw away empty toilet rolls but compost that paper. As this type of paper breaks down naturally and can be turned into a nutrient rich compost for your garden. The next tip requires a little investment. And the first one is use a bamboo toothbrush that is biodegradable while a plastic one contributes to a landfill waste. Regular toothpaste often has microplastic as an abrasive for cleaning your teeth. And they're often also packed in a plastic tube. While tooth tablets are completely plastic free and often come in a refillable glass container. Also choose a plastic free dental floss that is biodegradable like bamboo or silk. But you could also use a different method for flossing like using a water pick. Instead of using plastic bottles for your shampoo and conditioner, go for a bar because bars, shampoo bar, conditioner bar, are much more concentrated because they don't have any water. Meaning transportation is much more efficient and it is more nourishing for your hair. They often also contain more natural ingredients, meaning it is more gentle for your hair. However, not everyone likes bars for soap and conditioner. I have both, at least for my conditioner, because I prefer a liquid conditioner. So if you prefer a liquid version, go for something that is refillable, or at least is in a recyclable package, or like me, DIY your hair care products. And 
the same goes for hand and body soap. Go for a bar and select a brand that uses minimal packaging and sustainable materials during process. Go for hair ties that are metal and plastic free because those are not only better for our planet, they're also better for your hair. And the same goes for a comb and a brush. Avoid the plastic ones, but go for wooden or bamboo ones. Replace disposable cotton rounds for reusable ones. And if you wear a lot of makeup and don't like stains on your cotton rounds, go for black ones. Yes, there will still be stains, but at least you won't see them. But remember, even on white ones, these stains are just pigments that have been fixed within the fiber. If you wash them properly, they're clean. It's just the pigments that are stuck. That's not dirt, only pigments. Replace your disposable cotton swabs for either a reusable one or go for compostable ones made from biodegradable materials. And DIY your cleaning products for the bathroom. With only a few simple ingredients like vinegar and baking soda, you can properly clean your bathroom. This not only saves you from using a lot of plastic bottles, but also eliminates the amount of chemicals you use in your bathroom. And if DIYing is not for you, go for biodegradable cleaning products that are safe to go down the drain. The next tip requires a little bit more investment, like replacing your shower head for a low flow version. These shower heads provide the same experience while using up to 50% less water. Choose a shower curtain made from eco-friendly materials and the same goes for your bath mat. Opt to go for a bidet to minimize the amount of toilet paper used. Try a menstrual cup or reusable pads for your period. But if those are not for you, go for organic cotton tampons and pads. Go for an eco-friendly alternative to disposable razors, like investing in a safety razor or choosing a different method of hair removal, like an electric shaver, epilator or sugar waxing. Especially the last two methods generate a longer lasting result while generating much less waste compared to disposable razors. Choose eco-friendly skincare products to eliminate harsh chemicals on your skin. Even better if you have refillable options available near you. Otherwise, choose products that come in glass or bamboo. Metal is also a good option. Or you could DIY skincare products. The same goes for makeup brands. Choose eco-friendly brands that support your values. These brands avoid petroleum-based ingredients and go for natural materials instead. They're also packed more sustainably and are often refillable. If you love this video, check this one out as well.